kids are doing that. Now this is Jim Holla, he's from the Ocean City Pops. Let's have a nice hand for him. He's going to do the fanfare that he does before every race in the Hermit Crab race. This is how, I want you to know, this is how we start off the Hermit Crab races. Just like the Kentucky Derby. Okay, Ed Sullivan, do your thing. Thank you, Mark. Thank you, Jim Howell. For those of you that don't know Jim Howell, how about Al Hurt? Anybody know about Al Hurt? Well, when Jim Howell plays, Al Hurts. All right, now, we have some wonderful entries here. Maybe I will talk to a few of the entries and find out a little bit about them. Sir, where are you from? Sir, where are you from? York, Pennsylvania. York, Pennsylvania, and describe your flute. Uh, it sort of gets like a pirate theme, and a lot of the crabs seem to like to play on the pirate ship, so I decided to do this for their beauty pageant. Wonderful, and how old are you? Nine. When was the last time you got your hair cut? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Alrighty then, let's go to another entry over here. Come, come over here, young man. Come over here. My goodness, look at the money he spent on his uh, wardrobe Kathleen, and Kyle, his little float. To... What is your name? Zeph. Zeph. Can you tell your... God bless you. What do you have here? What is this? And describe it in detail for those of you that cannot see it. It's a circus, like, cage with heels, so you don't have to like take the animals out of the cage. And my crab's supposed to be in here. And what type of it is it? It's just a crab or a circus crab? It's a circus crab. Oh, I'm familiar with that. All right, let's 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 give him a big hand. A circus crab. Let's, how about you right there? Come right up ahead here. Right up ahead. All right, what is your name? Rachel. Rachel, describe your float. For everyone. The dog is walking the craft. Very ironic. Very ironic. I like that. And it's called Sandy. Stop it, Zane. Sandy and the crab. Sandy as in sand on the beach. All right, let's hear it for Rachel. That was very, very good. Come over here. All right, crab dashians. Come over here. Slowly but surely, slowly, slowly. My goodness, I've never seen so many toys all in one little food. What is your name? Amanda. And your name? Cat. Cat. All right, describe your float and who, who did it. Are you together here? Yeah, we're from Old Salt. Okay, and now to describe what you have here. It's the Kardashians and if it's Kardashians. So how many? Do, I can't tell you. Two or three or four. So give me each each of their names. Right, there's the mom over here. We got Bruce Jenner. We got Chris Kardashian. We got Khloe Kardashian. We got Courtney Kardashian. And of course, we got Kim Kardashian. We got Scott and uh, Little Mason. <laughs> any liposuction on any of the crabs? I cannot confirm or deny that. <laughs> All right, well, thank you very much. Get back in line here. Well, that is just wonderful. We do not have time for everyone to talk to you. So what are we going to do now, Mr. Mark? Sorry. Well, the judges are still working. Let's have the people from Old Salt. They're big. Uh, supporters of, uh, not Old Salt, from Air Circus, come over here. Air Circus. Air Circus and Pirates are us. We're the Pirates of Ocean City. We've got two crabs here. We've got Calypso here. She's a bit bigger. She's got a claw on her arm. And we've got Ariel over here. She's just a little bit smaller by about two years. She's all, she's all younger. We actually put this all together. We, uh, we screwed the, the top of the, the mast in here, here. And we actually... Uh, glued some of the bottom parts because we ran out of time. But, uh, as a pirate's very white, just uh, 
taking some shortcuts here and there. <laughs> we figured we'd come out here dressed up for these crabs and uh, hope you guys enjoy. Well, that's here for Air Circus. They have a great bunch of pirates. You can see them every night at Air Circus, and we just had a tribute to the Philippines. And Air Circus did a tremendous yo-yo exhibition for us. So see if, when you go to see them, see if you can get them to do some yo-yo tricks. They are really good. Yo-yo was uh, in, was invented in the Philippines. Yo-yo means return, return in the Philippine uh, language. That's something you can take home and tell your friends. Yo-yo means return, return. Okay. So it's educational. This is an educational event. The, uh, well, right now, we're waiting uh, for the judges to make their final decision, and they, I think, uh, let's bring up a couple more people then while we're waiting. How about the... Uh,